Patent Marketing Problems in India. Uh, Doctor Nilesh Dalvi, uh, Leech India, uh, India. Please. Doctor Nilesh. Namaste. Hello. Am I audible? Yes, yes. Please. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, I must say myself, Dr. Nilesh Dalvi. Uh, I am from India. Myself uh, is not a research person. I am a gynecologist. Uh, and uh, leech keeping and leech breeding is my hobby. First of all, I take the opportunity to say thank to this beautiful organization for this uh, international webinar and especially Dr. Mustafa Silan who gave me an opportunity and opportunity to express my views on leech industry in India. Uh, I will start my uh, presentation. Uh, as discussed with Dr. Mustafa Silon, uh, we selected the subject niche production and marketing problems in India. But uh, I would like to share my whole uh, scenario in, here in India about niche industry. Next so, Indian niche industry, the potential, the challenges, and new horizons. In Indian niche industry. Uh, next. Here is my introduction. I am a gynecologist and uh, I have done my BMS and MD in Ayurveda. And uh, Ayurveda niche therapy is a major uh, treatment modality in Ayurveda. So I got attracted towards niche and uh, I started working on this subject. Somehow I connected with Dr. Mr. Uh, Mr. Pasilon and Patrick Winterbot on Facebook. So they uh, explained me the beauty of this subject and I started working on uh, each drilling since 2016. Now we established a startup called Leech India in India that deals with leech breeding, leech reproduction, leech ship shipping and uh, leech selling all over the India. Let's see. So, uh, leech is called Jaloka in Sanskrit and in Ayurvedic text, Jaloka Anushastrana means the leech is used as a major sub uh, instrument, artery forceps, scalpel, blades, these are major shastras and Anushastras which are sub shastras. So, Jaloka Anushastrana Ashtangra Sangha, this is an old ancient Ayurvedic text that mentioned uh, the importance of leech. Here is the idol of uh, Lord Dhanvantari. Uh, it has four uh, hands and each hand is, uh, is with special uh, instruments like Shankha, Chakra, Jaloka and Amrutha. That means Jaloka, they are holding uh, Shankha means uh, a chakra, a spiral, and Janoka means leech. The Lord Dhanvantari, Dhanvantari is a god of Ayurveda that holds Janoka. Why neuronal therapy? Uh, leeches effectively remove full blood from the tissue and other medicinal therapy. Neuronal therapy increases nutrition of the tissue, so promoting wound healing and leech saliva content plays a bacteriostatic, bacteriostatic, and anti inflammatory, anticoagulant, etc. That's why hydrotherapy will suggest leech therapy is cheaper and reduces necessity of medicine. Leech therapy is a bridge between medicine and surgery. So we uh, advocate leech therapy or hydrotherapy. Indian leech industry, the potential. Leech, Indian perspective. Leech therapy is mentioned in Ayurvedic texts and Yunani medicine. Leeches are used by uh, Vaidyas, Hakims, and uh, 
naturopathist in india many non medical persons also use uh, therapy there are almost 686319 ayush practitioners in india of which 4,46,051 are ayurveda yogic practitioners so there is a huge number of uh, doctors are uh, using niches every day but uh, there is a great lacuna between supply and demand chain there is a growing awareness about niche therapy among vaidyas and humans so day by day niches are uh, more in demands this therapy is highly effective less invasive and sophisticated treatment modality hence gaining popularity in india indian medicinal niches there are two species are used uh, as a medicinal niches one is indian kettle leech aka hirunaria granulosa and asian buffalo leech aka hirunaria uh, madenensis and one other species is also mentioned that is kitnaria bitling that uh, that is in new that is a new species and work is going on in that species literature, literature on uh, indian species uh, indian leech is up to date has been uh, scattered there is a first comprehensive work on leech indian leech fauna was published by harding and boot that is in 1927 the sub subsequent literature on fauna is so scattered that it becomes very difficult to research keep themselves uh, abreast of the latest position in the group early and comprehensive work on indian niches was done by harding and boot and in which they dealt with almost 24 21 species and subsequent niches from the indian subcontinent now there are uh, 450 niches species are uh, available uh, record uh, records are available the reference for this above statement is uh, indian the niches of india handbook of uh, by mahesh chandra zoological survey of india niche industry in india deals with three parts one is pharmaceutical industry pharmaceutical industry uh, saliva content for hirudin dry niches for hirudin and cosmetic preparations traditional uh, medicine like hair growth i penile enlargement oils preparation the pharmaceutical in, uh, industry demands for leech for this purpose therapeutic industry leech uh, therapy is used in a traditional medicinal system like ayurveda yunani chinese medicine since uh, 2004 after approval from us fda plastic surgeons started using leech therapy in their operative process patients and uh, fisheries leeches are used as a bait uh, while uh, while getting fish from the uh, sea or fresh waters indian leech industry challenges this is an this is the photo of and sanskrit old classic text in which uh, that is mentioned that that, uh, that is i read for you kshetrani grahanam jati poshanam sa avacharanam jaloka satam so you will keep that asadhan charit data i translate for you this Sanskrit shloka from Sushru Sanhita. Sushru Sanhita almost dates back 2,500 years before Christ. That mentioned that the Vaidya who knows, the doctor who knows, habitat of leech, species of leech, feeding of leech, and leech application methods can treat difficult diseases. So uh, Sushru is a father of surgery. Sushru is a mentioned as a father of surgery. He invented many surgeries, and uh, his text is still. in use and many также используется many vaidyas are getting enlightenment from this text challenges in leech industry first of all uh, though this is a old we are using uh, leech uh, centuries ago and uh, from history uh, prehistorical time but taxonomical identification of medicinal leech is very lacking not properly done as i mentioned in your uh, slide uh, the classical work uh, is done for a few years back of the few hundred years back but uh, no other definite and uh, concrete work is done in taxonomical identification of therapy doctors mostly rely on uneducated vendors for supply and uh, that's why uh, they often get in problems which is found all over india especially in ganges uh, sundarban and many other water bodies but their habitats are not properly identified 
farmers consider wheat as a weed, so they try to eradicate leeches every day. The farmers and collectors do not know the commercial importance of the leeches, so they uh, don't bother about leeches. They just simply uh, kill the leeches or throw the leeches out. Excessive use of pesticides from the uh, farm wetlands is a major part of uh, leech extinction. Leech is not classified as an exportable commodity in any section, so licensing and shipping is not a smooth process. This is the main hurdle in leech growth uh, uh, in growth of the leech industry. Uncontrolled condition, the collection of the leeches of the water bodies may cause ecological imbalance. There is not uh, proper supply, there is not a proper supply chain for leeches, so doctors do not get supply good quality leeches, hence they avoid uh, the use of this uh, useful treatment modality. Leech breeding labs are not available in India. This is the highly potential area where scientific community can help us. Uh, there is no there is no proper leech storage capacity available in India, so it is hard to get properly quarantined leeches. These challenges we face in India, and uh, as I uh, come in contact with this, uh, the respectable research community from the uh, uh, all the world, especially from Kazakhstan and Europe, I get uh, information about the scientific breeding of leeches and uh, keeping of leeches. So now onwards, we are uh, focusing on scientific methods of leech keeping, breeding, and storages. Transportation. This is the major challenge in leech selling business. India have huge territory having different demographic environment conditions. Uh, do not allow to make a universal plan for leech keeping, selling, and uh, uh, breeding industry. High temperature causes high casualties in shipping. Mm -hmm. There is no standard protocol for shipping. No license issued by government for leech transport. Above points are hurdles mm -hmm. in uh, development of leech industry in India. Then industry new horizons. Few uh, arenas are there. So as this industry uh, means niche industry as a industry is new for India, though we are using from thousand years, but as an industry, as a commercial uh, uh, venture, entrepreneur, uh, enterprises, this is a new concept in India. So uh, as per my understanding, I, uh, I, I collected these arenas uh, for the industry. Education doctors is a big arena. Uh, people are using leeches. They don't therapy. Leech breeding and collection education for farmers. If uh, leech breeding and collection is, uh, is, teach, uh, is taught to farmers, they will uh, collect the leeches with awareness, and uh, this will be beneficial for each uh, field in India. Uh, if we success in development of better shipping methods, so this business will grow exponentially. And uh, as I told you, the number of Vaidyas and Hakims is uh, too big in India, and there is day by day that is increasing. So demand of leeches will increase. So shipping is uh, proper, then we can help the Vaidya uh, based on remote places and uh, small quantities also will be supplied. Niche storage center is a new concept. If any uh, pond is there and we are collecting leeches, and if we maintain a hygienic controlled storage center, then we can keep that leeches here and we can supply to the uh, practicing therapeutic, uh, practicing vaidya or doctor. Uh, that will be a good concept, uh, especially in India. There is a variation of temperature. Uh, every hundred uh, kilometer, and India is a huge problem. So, uh, different conditions uh, must be developed for these collection centers and storage centers. Uh, making available saliva extract for uh, industry uh, means if uh, major quantities will be available, then uh, saliva collection will be a simpler uh, task, and pharma industry will be benefited with that. And most important is leech breeding lab, though. We found 
abundantly in India, which is abundantly in India, but the right religious are having their own uh, epito importance because uh, as there is a uh, consumer protection act, we must aware of infections and media cellulitis developed due to the infections and uh, transfer of diseases from one person to another person due to leeches, we must aware uh, of this fact. So, uh, sterile leeches graded from the lab is very important. Single use of leech is very much uh, appreciated and advocated. But uh, for that, uh, the end number of leeches must be available for correction center. So, these are the horizons we think leech, uh, leech industry uh, is uh, huge distance to cover now and uh, we started in India we, we take a small step and uh, with the blessings of all the research community from all over the world we are growing well uh, last year we uh, take, uh, we took turnover of almost uh, 10,000 leeches uh, selling 10,000 leeches all over the India and uh, now we are gaining popularity among the vendors for uh, proper shipping methods and good quality leeches. Um, if uh, now uh, I have observed many presentations before, so I would like to learn from uh, you all and the development of this leech industry in India is most welcome. So uh, these are the horizons of leech industry in India. Conclusion is that so, recorded use of leeches is from prehistoric time mentioned in many classical texts like Vedas, Mahaparthas, and Sushrutamitas. Leeches are abundantly found in water bodies widely spread across the India. Leeches are used by traditional Vedas and since 2500 BC. Though this threat is known since centuries, leech production is the most underdeveloped area in leech industry. Leech identification, leech reproduction, development of leech sector is the need of our as. Leech therapy is gaining popularity among the doctors. Leech breeding centers, uh, leech collection centers, leech education for uh, medical students and breeders, these are the sectors need to be developed. Leech transportation, licensing for shipping abroad and inland are challenges for the leech industry. So I think uh, I try to uh, comprehend, means I try to collect the New challenges and uh, new horizons in the public industry in India. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for your uh, effective presentation. Do you have any question? Uh, but I can take only one question uh, because uh, time out now. Uh, Arkadaşlar çok teşekkür ediyorum. Ee, şu anda well, colleagues, thank you very much. Uh, if there is any question from the audience, we can take just one question because we have exceeded our time. If you have further questions, in fact, you can contact Mr. Uh, Dalvi and give your questions to him later on. But we have time for just one question now, if you have any. But I think there is no question for you, sir. Thank you very much. Well, I have some short contribution to make, in fact. Yes, Mr. Ceylan. Well, dear Nilesh, I'd like to thank you very much for your presentation. Since I uh, got to know you, in fact, uh, it has also been a chance for me to uh, follow the Indian leech sector. So I can compare the starting point and also your current position. There is a great difference and you create a great enthusiasm and a great movement in India. I witnessed this and uh, I hope all these uh, uh, works will continue with some R&D studies. Thank you very much for your inputs. Thank you. Thank you. Peki, çok teşekkür ediyoruz. Ee... Well, thank you very much.